spun around. Cindric goes around, coming off a two. The left rear, or the left front tire is down. Get it back going. Are you ready? Yeah, we kind of caught straight it. Straight to us, come straight to us. As he was spinning. So I'm not sure. Right front tire's down as well. It was a heck of a slide with no contact with that inside wall. He's yeah. running in fifth. Damage on the 47 of Stenhouse. Oh, Big damage. Big, yeah, yeah, a lot of right. damage. Kim. And obviously you see the damage there, right rear down on the 47 of Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Both of these drivers, Ricky and Austin Cedric, had been running in the top five when this incident happened. Let's take a look at what happened. Ricky running along here off of turn two, just gets loose. Oh, wow. Backed it around into the wall. And I think the two may have spun right there to avoid. So Cedric does a good job of not crashing into the 47, but also not hitting the wall. Look at that. It just came around on him. Look at Cendric. Wow, what? man. I mean, I, you know, I'll be honest with you. That's a pretty sharp, sharp driver right there. Good wreck avoidance for this two car. That's some Joey Chitlet stunt driving yes. on the two car right there. So Austin Cendric spinning. We saw it started with the 47 of Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Sliding coming out of turn two. And OK, Steve, now you've got a break. You're 33 to go in this race as your crew chief. What do you tell, for example, Tyler Reddick out front? Well, I think, look, if I have a set of tires and I'm, and I'm a playoff guy, I'm probably going to put my last.